Hello there. If you like truth, you'll like it here. Welcome. Dear Content Recycler, get off my areolas. Full disclosure, this is going to be quick because I literally don't have the time. I just got back from vacation. I haven't even unpacked my suitcases, but I jump in the shower and as I'm scrolling on my phone looking for some good music to shower to, I see the same content recycler because I refuse to call her a creator, but I see the same content recycler recycling my ideas and passing them off as her own. Just last night, this person who so desperately wants me to breastfeed her posted on her community wall that she is now starting to get tired of gay men mistreating straight women because they want the same things as those women, namely men, namely access to penises. If this thought sounds familiar, it's because it is. I have expressed the same sentiment in previous videos repeatedly, the most recent of which was on last Friday, where I discussed Carlos King's behavior towards women possibly originating from his affinity for men. I said I don't believe gay men are supporters of straight women, but see them as competition, because straight women are in possession of what gay men want, namely men. I have said this repeatedly and across multiple videos, and it's clear this content recycler watched my previous video from weeks ago and most recently the one on Friday. Yet, this content recycler didn't credit or acknowledge that. It is apparent that I inspire her. And that's good. That's what I'm here for. But when I do, shout that out. This content recycler is always so quick to shout out the established creators for clout, but will regularly borrow ideas from a smaller creator, such as myself, and pass them off as her own. I don't dislike this person, but she is starting to work on my last nerve. I prefer peace. I don't like discord and even have a pre-recorded piece coming out on Friday where I discuss the two content creators who are having a copycat beef, where I gently call for peace while acknowledging how disrespectful and grimy it is to be stolen from. So clearly I don't want drama, but I will always stand up for what's right and taking someone's ideas or their position on a subject without acknowledging them or the fact that you drew your inspiration from them is dishonest, weird, and sketchy. It is grimy, and I don't like it. You, content recycler, strike me as lost. I think you are trying to find your way, not just as a content creator, but as a woman. I think you are still trying to come into an identity. That is great. I wish the best for you. But as you're shopping around, trying to become whoever you were meant to be, Stop running over here and trying on parts of me, then trying to pass who I am and what I believe off as who you authentically are or what you suddenly also believe. It's gross and grimy. You clearly know how to acknowledge others and shout others out. I have seen you run around behind the more established creators and shout out everything they say, do, and post. They can't even sneeze online without you typing out God bless you in the comments and drawing them a Kleenex. You seem very thirsty for them to give you a pat on the head and a gold star. More power to you. But the same way you shout out the more established creators, you can also give some acknowledgement to the channels that are smaller than yours, whose ideas you keep shopping from. For the record, I don't want your acknowledgement. I'd rather you just stay off my channel and from under my skin. But if you are going to come over here and get inspired, you should credit the source. Stop passing off my ideas and thoughts and positions as your own. Aren't you an adult? Then why are you acting like a kindergartner who needs to color with the same crayons I am using? Stop it. Grow up and take off my panties. You are making my airy show, and I'd rather it not. Now this will be my last time asking. I have made posts on my community wall and have made a video about this, about you. I have not called your name because I was expecting you to feel some shame and self-correct and go away on your own, but you refuse. So I am asking again and for the last time, please be you. Stop coming over here and trying on my persona. As you will see in my video being released on Friday, I had hoped you had, though I also kind of knew better. 
If I inspire you, then say so. That's okay. That's what the right thing to do is. Stop Christopher Columbusing my content. This is my last time asking. Now, for everyone else, I'm sorry for that. That is not the way I wanted to come back and was not a part of the regularly scheduled programming. I have a post coming out later today, Wednesday, that I might move to tomorrow, Thursday, since I am now posting this video on Wednesday. Then I have a video coming out on Friday. Please excuse the brief detour in scheduling. I don't like all this and hate to participate in or promote discord or drama. I truly hate this, but I hate a copycat more. So it is what it is. I hope you guys will join me on Friday for the video I've got planned. Until then, enjoy y'all's week. All right, y'all. That's it, and that's all. Hello there. If you like truth, you'll like it here. Welcome. If you don't, or if you believe in groupthink, or bullying others into believing the popular opinion, then this isn't the place for you. So go ahead and just cancel me now. On this channel, we don't discuss my truth or your truth. We discuss the truth and no topic is off limits. So log in, like, subscribe, get comfy and comment. It's nice to have you here. So let's talk.